You're not gonna believe this. I'm filling up here at Maverick somewhere in rural Route 66 in, in Holbrook, Arizona. And the guy in the next car is this man, Fred Madley. Is that right? Correct. Right. And he claims to have helped design this car. You wanna tell me your story, Fred? Yeah, I came to work for America Motors in 1961. They worked for Dick Teague, Vice President of Styling for America Motors. And uh, Chuck Manashian was our group leader. And so we were in band styling, and I did a lot of the fiberglass work and clay work on this car. Really? Yeah. So you were more the body styling than the engine? Yes, not had nothing to do with the engine. Well, the reason I, I asked that, can you pop the hood there? I want to show you something that I was going to blame you for. Do you remember how to do that? No, I haven't. Underneath the grill there. Yep, you're almost right there. Pull that up. Because I was going to blame you for this garden spigot right there. I was going to no. say, that looks like something Fred Madley would have put in there. Not a chance. Not a chance. No. Yours was the look. Yeah. Now, from what I've read about this car, this was the first year of the, of the redesign. I believe it is. That's right? I believe it is. And uh, from here, we, we created a thing called the tarpon, which was a, a fastback. That's the, the marlin, right? Well, tarpon. Never came out. Never came a, out. It was a design, and then they moved to a Marlin, and that's the one we created with the Fastback. Isn't that a beautiful car? It's a beautiful car. Do you like the Tarpon or the Marlin better? Oh, the Tarpon. Really? Down. Oh, it was like the Ford Mustang Fastback. Just hot, huh? And it had a big V8 in it. Yeah? And it was hot. Just hot? Yeah. And it, it would run. It could run against any Mustang or GTO. So did they make one, and you drove it? it was, no. It so was, it only it ran only fast in your dreams? In, yep. It had the engine. <laughs> well, the engine... In fact, was put in a, a Rambler station wagon, and I had a Chrysler 300, which was one of the fastest cars on the street. And we got into a drag race with a Corvette, <laughs> and the the Rambler stayed with me all the way, and we blew the Corvette off. A, a Rambler station wagon. A Rambler station wagon, but with a huge V8. Thing but what, but did, did, did the wagon have like? Was it loaded with kids? The wife and kids? No, not a kid. No. no, it was a driver from American Motors. That's amazing. Yeah, so it was. It was the ideal car. We could have been in the months of business with no problem. But but yeah, you fell behind that, didn't you? They did. Well, they That's didn't the do suits. It. The suits up there made that decision, didn't well, they? George Romney left American Motors at that time, and then they had a battle at the top, and Walnut Road destroyed that company, in my opinion. Well, we won't let him watch this video because we don't want to get you in trouble. I don't care if they do or don't. Who cares? <laughs> yeah. So can you do one more thing before I let you get back sure. to your car? So since you design this, you're involved in the design. What are your favorite design I desi things? I didn't design it. I was a clay modeler. Okay, but you were involved with the styling. Okay, so what are your favorite physical characteristics about this car? Can you show me? Well, actually, I, you know, some of the things we did is, you know, the look is just wonderful. At it's beautiful. Time, at the time, it was just perfect. Yeah. But, you know, everybody else moved on, and we just stayed here. Right. And that was the end of it. I like the rear end of this car. Oh, I do. I like the It's beautiful, car. isn't it? Yeah. Sleep back here. I like that. Yeah. Is there anything you did that's, that's just yours that like you didn't tell anybody you did? Well, the fiberglass, I would have made the body, the whole body. Just on fiberglass body? Yeah, we meant to come off a uh, fiberglass, I mean a, uh, a uh, plaster mold. Yeah. And then we made a fiberglass body and we put it on there and we painted the thing and it also looked like a real car. So you did that? Yeah. Did you put an engine in that? No. That would have been fast. All right, well, George, I'm going to let you get on your journey. Right. It means a lot. All right. Thanks a lot. You're Fred, welcome. I'm sorry to let you keep you a little longer, but I want to ask, did you ever work on, like, the AMS or the Javelin oh, project? Yeah. We did all the clay modeling on it. We did the whole design on it and uh, put it all together through Chuck Manassian's uh, 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 studio. And uh, it was candy apple red. The model was. The, 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 yeah, the prototype was yeah. candy apple red. And we got it all done, and it was beautiful. And they covered it up in the basement, and it was like five years sitting there before they actually come out and start talking about working on it. Get out of here. They, they just hit it. You just made that beautiful car and then... Wrapped it up because of the squabble. I think it was a squabble at the top. Kind of like the Tarpon Project, it sounds like. It, it was. Yeah, any other... Are there any other... For, for, for the AM, AMC fans who might be watching this video... Yeah. Are there any other good, like, little nugget stories you've got of where AMC killed itself? <laughs> well, that, that, that basically was it. Then I went on and opened my own shop and custom cars, and I did uh, show cars for Ford and Chrysler Styling, interiors mainly. 
So I did a lot of show cars for them, including the flower car to come out with Chrysler years ago was a Barracuda. Wow. So, you know, yeah, there was a lot of these things going on. So my next trip needs to be to Michigan and hang out with you. That wouldn't be a bad idea. What city in Michigan are you in? Uh, Brighton. Is that, is that outside Detroit? Yeah, south, just north of Ann Arbor. Okay, so uh, if I make a road trip up there, should I drive a Rambler? Whatever you want. Just bring it up. Yeah, bring it up. Man, that's great to meet you. Yeah. Thanks, man. Are you Thanks, welcome. Fred. Take care. See ya.